No, it's fine, I've got it. Okay. Yeah, I have enough money. Where are we going now then? We are going. Search. Oh, just generally in the Valley of Kings. Okay. More attack speed, more physical damage. It's the same physical damage plus 16 dexterity. Just need to. Uh, I have literally no money now, actually. <laughs> Used all my money on that. Still, nice upgrade, finally. Had this for a lot of levels. Is the mystic dude over there? The, the dude with the lightning bolt over his head? Uh, he's in the entrance. Right, I just want to see how much it's going to cost me to freaking separate this. 137,000. Fantastic. Just going to sell some of the crap I've got hanging around in my stash. God, I got a lot of crap just hanging around in here. And I thought it was good. Just imagine if we lived in this world, there'd be just rooms and rooms stacked of crap. I mean, we might need it at some point. The hoarders would not be a, a thing. It would just be standard. Everyone would be a hoarder. Yeah. Okay, so let's recover the relic or charm. I am almost 500 DPS now. As I say, do you want to get to the end of this act and do some Starcraft? Or yeah, sure, sure. I don't have the hugest amount of time today because we are going out later. Yeah. But um, yeah, I was enjoying that. Can I get them down there? Again. We have the high ground, Scorp again. <laughs> Don't try it. Can't shoot anymore. Oh, you, 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 did you fire on? Yes, it is, yeah. Hmm? Did you fire on? Yeah. I'm just not close enough to get it at the minute, so... No, it's only like level 2 or something. Just a free bit of uh, extra damage, really. Sandstone Guardians. They're actually really hard to hit. Priest. Oh, was that a quest? That was a side quest, apparently. You receive a magical weapon. But it's going to be great. Need something. I need a staff that actually increases uh, vitality damage and not fire damage. Oh, you all vita uh, vitality damage? Yeah. Well, I assume so. Um, my passive here increases physical damage and vitality damage, so I assume so. Would make sense. It just says 140 damage, it doesn't say anything about vitality. Oh uh, yeah, I think I think actually my distortion wave does physical damage. You're physically distorting their dreams. Yeah, because everything else has vitality damage and. Uh... Yeah. Hmm. Weird. Well, we'll go back to that after then, because uh, I don't want to waste. Do the one now. We've got to take it back to the priest, haven't we? Say that we've killed the. Do we? Uh, yeah. Oh, you got to take it back. Oh right. 
Um, I have no oh, that was a Herog. Oh, he's dead. Bank of Isis. I remember what that one does. Chance to be had. Oh, just, that's just health and <laughs> savage. That was dark. That's, Jesus. That's spi spicy joke. <laughs> censor that for the DVD release. There was a, oh my god, there was something earlier. We were watching MasterChef, and one of them was doing some, a Madeline or something like that. And Louisa was like, "What the hell is a Madeline?" And I was like, "Oh, it's a, it's a bit of meat that they put in a pot. They leave for a while, then it gets stolen." <laughs> like fucking hell, dogs. Jesus. That took a turn. Yeah, I was like, should we come the next Frankie Boyle? Not racist jokes, just really, really offensive to everyone. I was like, that's quite funny. If, yeah. if unbelievably in poor taste. That's the best joke. Yeah. There's a bottom hawk here. Yeah, I see. You can actually click the fucker. Okay, then. Oh, you better found him. Just like four tombs. Up from us. So many tombs. The first episode of my Fallout 3 Kill Everything uh, melee run. Uh, it, it's fairly popular. There's a, there's a few thousand uh, uh, views on it. And uh, when Liam okay. Neeson goes, Oh, this was your mother's favourite Bible quote. And I was like, Lol, Bible's bullshit. And there's a few people like saying, well, I'm offended that he said the Bible's bullshit. So? <laughs> and I linked to a um, link to an image of Stephen Fry uh, telling people that whoever uh, get offended, no, why should we even give a shit? Yeah, exactly, who gives a fuck to offended? Deal with it. Oh, I was listening to, a, listening to a podcast yesterday and they were talking about uh, Russia and how their, their rules are really stupid um, and someone, uh, some atheist, had gotten charged with hurting the feelings of a religious person. <laughs> I was at work when I was like, and I was driving, and I just burst into laughter, like hurting the feelings. Holy shit! That's that's ridiculous. <laughs> the dumbest thing I've ever heard. Another analyzed glory. I shall combine that. With my... No, no, that's what you want. There you go. What is it? That's oh, the percentage yeah, yeah. energy and all that. Health and. Oh, yeah, I need one more now. Think you're looking, think you're this. Oops. Happens to all the boys, that does. What uncontrollable dream destruction. <laughs> yeah. I'm gonna farm the shit out of that, um... Ooh, maybe another level. One of the shine of experience, every. Into. Yeah, let's put them in the multi arrow thing. Why not? Why not? I did a test run of the uh, new character, level 75 legendary run. Oh, yeah. Uh, you can kill them, they just do so much damage. You've got to run away really quickly. So, yeah, okay. it's, it's very dependent on gear. Yeah. Because I copied this character and gave it a try. And, like, ugh. Even with even with some of the good weapons, five two thousand gold. I'll take that. Yes, but but obviously you wouldn't go straight into legendary. I mean, you have to go through epic no. first. So yeah, yeah. What I'll more than likely do is once we finish this, I'll stop recording, and then once we get to legendary, I'll start recording again. Yeah, it makes more sense. Because I'm not doing that. Let's go back to. Was it? Oh, we missed a place. Where are we going to? Valley of the Kings. Yeah, we want to go to the Valley of Kings. Oh, we're already in the Valley of Kings, aren't we? Oh, are you? Is that 
one above. I didn't get the one for Thebes. Can you put the thing down? Oh, did you not? Okay, yeah. No, I was wondering, like, I was like, I don't remember missing anywhere. Table, uh, Temple of Seti. There you go. It's down. Thanks. Seems like, um... My weapons oh, are seems like this, um, act is going significantly quicker. Well, we are killing them really easily now, so that's probably half the reason. Ugh, terrible weapon. 16 to 55 lightning damage, though. Uh, I mean, <sighs> what's up? I mean, sixteen to fifty lightning damage is is all right, but uh, my offensive ability goes down so much. Give me dexterity. Thirty-six <laughs> life leech dexterity. Ah, oh. they, they have to be alive for you to benefit from life leech. Yeah, that's the issue, really, isn't it? You're killing everything in one shot. I could store goods for you. Have to wait for uh, how to finish then. It's a good amount of extra damage, but uh, I don't care. Right. I shall wait for you back at the Valley of Kings. I'm already there. Okay. I'll wait for you there. Yeah. <laughs> Evidently. Sounds like everything's wrapped in a neat little package. <laughs> uh, we're not going into the... Uh, tombs? The tomb here? Is there a tomb where you are as well? Oh, I didn't see that one. Let's go come back. Don't know what tomb I meant to go in. Nope. Search for... we just got to go through all the fucking tombs. It'll be the last one, I guarantee. I'm um, Amenhotep. Amenhotep? I hardly know her. <laughs> Who put a bomb in it? <laughs> Hey little Timmy, would you like to see Grandma? Yeah, sure! <laughs> Gee, thanks, mister! <laughs> dreams! I missed. How do you miss someone's dreams? I'm trying to think of a good pun there, but nothing. Good one. Yeah. Nailed it. <laughs> I'm good at life. I'm an adult. How's, how's your energy regen? It's alright. I need to use um, potions sometimes, but I've still got 50 of them, so really, it's irrelevant, really. Another place of leggings is the hunt. Actually, I had to sell the other ones to make of that bow. So, it's a nice, nice little. Uh, it all worked out in the end. I had to sell all of your clothes to, to buy a new bow. The Ujet and Horus, what was that one again? Just armor. I'm guessing this isn't the one, unless that tiny little place we haven't checked is where. There you go. 27, I need to level up twice more to even get a chance to get... Well. To get what now? Uh, to get full 32. Anything down there? Nope. There's a few dead monsters now. It's a 
fire arrow, fiery arrows. God, Greece and Egypt must stink. The amount of oh, dead, yeah. rotting corpses we've left behind. Mm. Disgusting. But they love it too. Mm. Let's grab this battle marker. There's another tomb up to the right. And there's also an experience shrine just out of it. I like experience. Handy. Two. Oh, it's Frostbite. Bullshit. That's significantly less useful. I don't like Frostbite. The men misses. Come on. Chance to hit these guys is really low. What level are they? 21. Should be fine hitting them. It's just the, it's just the big guys. Which is silly, really, considering they're big. I'm assuming they just have really high defense, and that translates into. They've got defensives that we, that we miss sometimes. Mm. Oh, Heracles might. Hercules, the well known. I don't know. Mm. Nah, just... It's so big. That's definitely not this one. They just nicked this from Diablo 2. At the end of Act 2, you had to go through a shit ton different to of different tombs to see which one was the real one. That was a mod. It was a right pain in the ass if you were trying to do farming. Mm-hmm. But there was a mod you could get that just like showed you which one it was. <laughs> and revealed the rest of the map too. It's a really good mod. Back like when, you know, Diablo was modable. Let's not talk about it. <laughs> Makes me sad. And that's with shields. Yeah, it's just pierce resistance. You do that, eh? You need resistance? resistance. No, I did the pierce damage. Experience shrine down here. Significantly increased. I disagree. Yeah, it's not really that much, is it? Experience sponsored by Tesco. Is that Tesco's one? Mm hmm. Prumar the enslaved, a zombie hero. Oh. Hero. Hey, zombies can have heroes. Wait a minute. Heroes on both sides? 
Can evil robots really be called heroes? Oh well. I just watched that one yesterday. I listened to that one yesterday. I've got it on my phone. <laughs> Favorite line in the whole thing is um, what he says about um, he pledges his he, he kneels before Monster Mash and pledges his allegiance to the Graveyard Smash. <laughs> Want any pizza rolls? Want a pizza roll? Email me if you want a pizza roll. <laughs> Okay, that's another dead end. I always thought uh, Mr. Plinkett was uh, Richard, Richard, uh, Richard Evans, but it's uh, Mike, isn't it? Yeah, it's Mike, yeah, mm. yeah. He just plays him in the, the live action ones. Uh -huh. That's so funny. Have you listened to their. Um... Force Awakens one? Yeah, no, yeah. no, no, not Force Awakens. Uh, Rogue One. Their. Um... Their analysis. Their tracks. Oh no! Not I... the analysis, no, the rift tracks. It just came out. Oh no! No, it's, it's, oh. Uh, you play it with the movie, and it's them talking, and it's like it really highlights some of the problems that I had with that movie. There was a lot of things wrong with it. I haven't actually seen either of the two new Star Wars movies. So, I thought working is decent. Oh well, I couldn't give a shit to be honest with you. Oh, it's a good movie. Yeah. People make it out to be way more than it is. Like it's just a fucking Star Wars movie, but I had a good time watching it. Well made. It's exciting. You're not a Star Trek guy. Oh. Very good. I'm more of a Star Trek guy, yes. Oh, yeah? You like, um... I like it when Spock. Data data goes to the Force. Yeah, Data's good at that. Mm -hmm. He's a mechanical Force droid and all that. I like it when Data has the emotion chip. Oh, God. Worst idea ever. How to make data really annoying. Well, these are new. What are these enemies? The shadow things. Hmm. Nah, I've seen it before. Alright. Not cool to me. I've been there, done that. No, I think you're fine that I did it before. It was cool. Yeah, I did. I'm tired to quite hipster. Ooh, hello. Green helmet. Any good? Terrible. <laughs> Imagine that. Yeah, I can do with a replacement for this helm because it's just it's the rogue one that I borrowed off my um, other guy. Decent helmet would be awesome. Five, good God. Ooh, you might want this. What is it? Cinderbolt. Burn damage, fire damage, burn damage, dexterity, health, and energy. Oh, that could be good. Thank you. Got a battle marker here.
There's still loads on the on the left. Is it? Hmm? But I'm down here now. So There's not any more I killed them. Even the younglings? Even the younglings. Yeah, they take the piss out of the uh, out of Star Wars fans pretty bad. <laughs> no. Because they maintain it's just for children. Have you seen the podcast they do? Well, quote podcast. Sometimes. I don't know, actually. I, might, I thought I did. Uh, I forget what it's called. It's not a proper podcast at all. It's just a piss take of the podcast, but it's really well done. Oh, the nerd thing. Yeah. Um, the nerd. Yeah. It's so funny. Yeah, I like those. That's somewhat geniuses, really. Mm. Smart guys, they know what they're doing. Take some of these jars. They look quite expensive. Nope. No jars. I can break them. Oh. An eight stone door. I'm gonna find them in the cell phone. Yes, we are. Hello. Hi. We're gonna kill you now. No talking at all. Just go straight for the kill. You almost had me then. Oh. Good work. So close. Yep. What? Um, do we burn if we stand in those, or what it's supposed to do? It doesn't even hurt. Souls. Kate's crescent is energy. Let's see what soul sugar does. Physical damage, vitality damage, Hello. life leap damage, nine percent of attack damage. Convert to health. There you go. Hmm. Take a look at it. Vitality damage is nice, but I don't know. I kind of like the attack speed. Hmm. That's why I can't replace mine. Mm, think about it. Yeah, well. Uh, Lupin we Claw, Vile Eye, and Anubis is wrath. Take the strange tablet back to Thebes. Oh. This? I can do. Ah, that seems like that's Act 2 done. Oh, yeah. It seems we'll see. a bit easier. It's a bit easier than Act 1, if that's the end. There's no more areas to go to. Oh, actually, there is. There's the uh, Gate of. Scepter of Serenity. I got Scepter of Eternity. Two skill points. Ooh. Nice. Getting closer. Bomber from the uh, Gentrix seems to tremble. What the fuck does it do? It's just a quest item. It seems almost useless. Yep. Yeah. I'll probably use it for something later. Caravan storage? You're used for something later. Take that. Oh, uh, I have a. Yeah, I have a arcane formula here that you might want. Oh yeah. Dropped a while ago. Where are you? Yeah, yeah there it is. 
Razor Claw, huh? Bonus to all pets as well. Huh. Yeah, with five plus five percent pierce damage, plus fifteen piercing damage, plus thirty percent, plus a bit of attack speed. Farewell. I will have to see. You can ignore that letter to mummy on the ground. It's a stupid fluff item. Goodbye. Yeah, it looks like yeah. We just got one more thing to do. Travel to Babylon. There, the gates are open. Go, hero. The gates are open, go, hero. I'm just happy for the attribute points. Not attribute points, skill points. I was going to say, he made me have a look at the attribute earlier. Like, Ooh, we can get some more. Hello, everyone. Ah, I've been, I've been netted. This is the parched. What a terrible hero name. Temple now. But this is overrun oh, by baddies and whatnot. Left. I'm very curious, wonder what can be left. Leaving. Oh. No, I got him. Oh, there's a name guy down there. Let's go fix his wagon. Oh, hello. Trickster's tunic. Please be a fucking... Let's do the flash powder. God damn it, it's a rogue one. I might turn that guy I... That other guy I have into a... Um, Full-on... Damage guy, melee guy. Yeah, yeah. Serving. You get rid of defense and just go poison or something On, like that. No, I'd, I'd, I'd go. Um, warfare. Uh, warfare, that's the one, yeah. There's a build online. It's the person that one of the highest damage, well, the highest damage class in the game, but it's like very glass cannon, so. Mm. But fun. I found another piece of that Thebes set when I was doing Max Wand. Like that, but it seems pretty decent. What's in here then? Oh, there's a massive stone door. Uh, hard to get through. Yeah, it does that sometimes. Well, don't don't forget to get the rebirth fountain. Just in case. Death is a very rare thing in this game, which is nice. Well, we're on normal. Oh yeah, true. <laughs> Like running through Diablo on normal and being like, oh, it's pretty, it's pretty. pretty. <laughs> Can't wait to play on Torment. Yeah, there's a the thing. Bloody fire trap, go away. Prometheus. Can we turn back? It's terrible fell. It really was. So like Interstellar. Rubbish. Interstellar was one of the worst ones I've ever seen in my life. It ruined me. <laughs> Don't 
And if Mr. Telkan isn't the last boss, I wonder what it is. The last, last boss. I've won two in my tel final form. Super Telkan. It's Kel'Thas. Call it now. You bothered about the option areas? Nope. It's this fire trap. <laughs> Tease goes now, okay. I'll speak of the devil. Nightmare of the desert. I want to go here. Yawn. Good for selling. Can we get a mod that changes all the colours to wow colours? A portal? That's lazy. No, oh, actually, Babylon, that might be. Is that an area? That's, or? that's the next act, I think. <laughs> Let's talk to this guy. Why, Inanna? I thought the portals were a myth. How did you get it to work? But never mind that. Yep, there we go, Act three. Fabulous. Grab the thing and leave it there. Babylon's in China? Alright. Yeah, didn't you know that? No, I didn't actually, yeah. 